Hi Virgo, welcome to my third channel, my Virgo only channel. My name is Chelsea and it's reading for those of you in a complicated relationship. We're going to find out what's your person's intention with the future of this connection. Today is the 29th of May 2024. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 11.24 a.m. And Virgo, I'm giving away a free personal reading once a week for a lucky winner. To enter, hit like, subscribe, and comment below. I love Virgo. If you have commented before, you can do it again. It will increase your chance in winning. And winners will be announced on the community page weekly. All right, spirits and angels, please show me for Virgos in a complicated relationship. What's the per what is the person's intention with the future of this connection? Bear in mind, Virgo, that this is this is just a general reading may or may not resonate with you from the beginning till the end, and uh, a complicated relationship could be a relationship that's maybe long distance third party situation situationship or there is no label to this connection yet um just a complicated relationship okay we've got the king of cups but whatever the case is this relationship is not secure yet your person could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, could be Leo, could be Taurus, can be any sign. Pisces, again, very strong water I'm picking up on. I feel like Virgo, your person in a, where you're in a complicated relationship right now, loves you, cares about you, may have also fallen in love with you, okay, because there's Ace of Cups. So their feelings for you have increased. The strength here is them holding back. And the King of Cups likes to hold back his feelings as well. So I feel like Virgo, their intention for the future of this connection is to, is to commit. Because the Hierophant is a commitment energy. Okay, But because of the Six of Pentacles, it could mean like they want to commit eventually, but they don't want to limit their... Um, options and also especially if they're still talking to someone else dealing with someone else um, I see them doing that for now but the intention is to finally choose one and then to commit and the Hierophant is also a marriage card okay so I feel like your person even though in a complicated relationship is pretty um, pretty serious with you eight of cups judgment hangman so your person in a complicated relationship they hangman is like a pause i need time i need to see i need to wait before i can walk away from something okay whether it's walk away from their country if this long distance relationship walk away from their comfort zone walk away from their other person or other options um, walk away from their job for you, you know, just basically, you know, um, just needing to sacrifice, the hangman indicates sacrifice as well, sacrifice their life for you, sacrifice their time for you, sacrifice other people for you, okay? But the judgment here means, like, they want to see everything first, they want to make sure nothing is hidden, and, um, and that they, they, they will feel like more comfortable in choosing you, uh, choosing, choosing to be um, married to you or choosing to marry you. But they're pretty serious, I have to say. Um, Nine of Pentacles as well. Okay, good. So it could be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. You're, the person you're in a complicated relationship with, they are pretty committed to you. Even though, you know, it's like maybe they have options. Um, just giving an example, maybe they have options, but their focus is more like on you. The rest is just so that they know, you know, they don't, <laughs> they don't miss out. Not really like don't miss out. Like, it's just like when you go shopping, you're comparing prices or you're comparing dresses. You can only buy one. You have to try a few different dresses before you pick the right one for you. It just feels like that. Okay, this might, might not be the best um 
uh, best way to describe it, <laughs> but but Virgo, yeah, this is how I feel. Okay, the King of Cups, but they have a lot of love to give. I have to say, um, they have a lot of gift, love to give, and they are kind of like preparing themselves to make sacri certain sacrifices for you. But they have, they want to make sure that it is going to be worth it. But once they, once they commit, once this complicated relationship turns into like a serious relationship. I feel like they're gonna be fully committed, okay? Knight of Cups is in well first, Four of Pentacles in well first. Yeah, I do see them eventually, maybe they're, they're not gonna hold on anymore to, you know, other connection or other things that, that could be important, somewhat important for them right now. There's a king and then there's a knight. Yeah, they're de definitely holding back in terms of falling deeply in love with you. Um, right now, they could be the Knight of Cups in reverse. Doesn't mean that they don't love you, but they do. But just basically feels like holding back from, you know, putting all eggs in one basket. Yeah, I must say that they are very much attracted to you. Ace of Wands. They don't want any drama. So if there has been third party situation, drama, I feel like your person is trying to see like if you can bring them peace, right? Will that be peace after if I was to fully commit with the higher fund? Justice is in love first. For some of you, literally, if this is a complicated relationship where it involves someone else, like another marriage or another very committed relationship, I feel like the intention for the future of this connection would be to release another person, release another relationship. Page of Pentacles in reverse. That feeling of like, I don't want to make promises yet. So... They don't want to make promises that they can't keep, but they feel like, again, they don't want to make the promises. They don't want to make promises that they cannot keep, but at the same time, the Ace of Wands, they want to have that fire to continue burning because Ace of Wands, you know, it's a fiery energy, that romance to continue. Um, I feel like this could be somebody whom can be quite romantic if they want to be, okay? Now, two aces are here. Again, this could ev either, this is just for some of you. Again, if you're in a complicated relationship because your person has someone else or you have someone else at the same time, so this is like a choice. Do I choose somebody whom is closest to my heart or do I choose that one person who is way more exciting, that I'm way more passionate about, that I'm way more passionate for. Okay, death here is in love first. Death can indicate, for some of you, you might end up in a complicated relationship because um, there was a separation, back and forth. If that's the case, like separated, coming back, separated, coming back, like in and out kind of a, a relationship, that makes it complicated, right? Because it feels like it's not, Mm, strong it feels it's like it's not stable so but the intention is to eventually stabilize it but then the strength here is is that feeling of can I control this situation so that it doesn't go out of hand again hmm. let's just see a little bit more here for a go yeah three of swords and over four cups Yep, to say no to other options and also to release something, the pain. Um, if you have somebody who can't forgive you because of something that has happened that could have something to do with betrayal, that's just for some of you. Your person's intention is to want to release this pain and making sure that they can truly trust you, the Hierophant, before, before they take the connection to the next level or before they reconcile, okay, with you, fully reconcile. 
Sometimes reconciliations may not be like a full reconciliation. It's like a half reconciliation. Let's see where it goes. And it makes it really complicated. That's just for some of you, okay? But then this release here could again indicate your person has the intention to release someone else. Could be a marriage again or other options. But they, they're not in a hurry. Look at the King of Cups sitting down. Hangman is also hung upside down. So they're not in a hurry. The strength here is them tr uh, trying to tread very carefully, deal with the situation very tactfully so that it wouldn't cause any drama, and then slowly maybe walk away from whoever they want to release for you. Bear in mind it could go vice versa. So, but Virgo, I feel like your person doesn't want any drama. Wants like some sort of understanding, stability, Knight of Pentacles, peace basically if they feel like being with you is more peaceful than not then they will rather choose to be with you and take the connection to the next level all right Virgo this is your reading I hope uh, you resonated in some way shape or form don't forget to hit like share and subscribe subscribe anyways if you've been here many times before and you haven't subscribed yet it's free to subscribe and also, um, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button if you like to be notified every time I post your videos. And also, um, check out my main channel, Chelsea Love Tarot. I'm going live later on my main channel, as well as uh, my travel channel. Check out my travel channel as well. All right, take care, Virgo. I hope to see you back here again soon. Love ya. Bye.